Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a BoxyCharm video. Um, I filmed my last BoxyCharm, but it didn't actually make it up. <laughs> so I have um, most of my base done. I did my eyebrows with a pencil. I have concealer on my eyelids. Um, I did peek at the box to see what was in there, so I knew what to do and what not to do. Um, and we're just gonna jump right in. Let me see. I'm not going to be using the mask on camera today. I will probably use it when I take my makeup off. Um, that's the only thing in the box that I won't be attempting to use. And other than the mask, we have an, I think it's called a Des High Definition Liquid Lipstick. Ooh, it's like, um, it's pretty brown, actually. I want to say it's like an orangey red brown. It's not, it's not a color that I would typically reach for but we will see. And there's a Tardis Pro Glow Liquid Highlighter. And they gave me the shade Sparkler, which I can already tell it's gonna be way too dark, but we'll see how it works anyway. Um, I have lighter highlights that I can put on top, so we'll see if we can't save it. And then we have the Brow Gal um, Tinted Brow Gel with little, where there you go? little brow fibers um and mine is in brown hair my hair is black so I'm thinking if it's too dark I might be able to set it with a dark eyeshadow or you know just a dark powder and that we get a whole palette I, I mean I know it's ColourPop but ColourPop is so good so good so I have the you had me at hello palette um but I love the packaging it's it's like um like a soft velvet, I think what they call it. But it's really, I'm liking it. I haven't even opened it. Ooh. <gasps> it's got purples. Like this purple right here. And then these have some purple in them. It's, it's a really, it's an all around, really versatile palette it looks like. That's an awful swatch, but... Look at that shimmer. Wow. So you open it and it has this little tiny spoolie. It is pretty light, so we'll see. The color's not that bad. It's it's not. It's really kind of suck like soaking up into my hair. My eyebrow hair. I have naturally pretty thick eyebrows so as far as it making your eyebrows you know plumper and thicker and things like that I I'm not seeing that but that doesn't mean it's not happening so maybe I'll kind of want to try it without a pencil underneath it yeah see it warmed up my brows a lot lot okay so I'm gonna go in with the palette what do I want to do okay so I'm gonna go in with this color and I'm gonna go all over my lid and up into my crease and this this $16 palette this palette is $16 and it has a bomb mirror bomb okay here we go
and did some liner and um, mascara off camera. I used um, my Tarte. It's a Tarte liner. I don't know which one. <laughs> then I used um, Man Eater mascara, also by Tarte. And next, I'm also going to do a Tarte product. Um, I'm really, <laughs> I'm so scared to put this on my face because it's the darkest highlighter available. And I'm super fair. Every foundation, I'm like the lightest shade. So I'm going to take a little bit on the back of my hand. And we'll see what happens. Okay, it's not that bad once it's... Oh my god. <laughs> There's just a huge shadow. No! Yeah, I'm not using that. I, I can't. It would look... Ooh, it would look really pretty as like an eyeshadow topper. Let me try that. definitely changed the eyeshadow in a way I didn't think it would. Well, there's no going back now. I'm going to grab uh, my Makeup Revolution Love Conquers, Conquers, <laughs> Love Conquers All palette and then my Urban Decay Kristen Leanne palette. So I'm going to what I do is I mix, I normally mix these two together, but I'm just going to take the lighter one because this one is already so dark. Oh. In person, that shadow is not that bad, but you can see it right there. It's just awful. And I'm going to mix this, this silver and this like lavender looking color. I'm not mad. I'm not mad at all. Makeup Revolution. Killing it. Killing it. Okay. So the next is the Odessa New York liquid lipstick. Mine doesn't have a shade name or anything. So I don't know if that's just how they are. Like they only have one shade or, or what. I guess I could have looked it up. But I'm not going to. It smells like something. It smells like something. I have no idea what that something is, but it smells like something. Oh my god. Okay. The color <laughs> The color is not for me at all. I I don't like this color it's it's like a clay color but more brown and more it's sticky it's very sticky um just the color oh i can't get over the color i cannot get over the color um let me throw some gloss on see if that That did nothing. Yeah, that did absolutely nothing. Um, I have a feeling I won't be reaching for that lipstick just based on the shade. It's a pretty shade. I just don't think it looks good or, or decent on me. Um, but anyway, this is my look from my boxy charm, and I hope you guys like it. Please like and subscribe if you would like to see more. Hit me in the comments. Let me know what you would like to see. If there's anything you want me to review, try, do, let me know. Um, thanks, and I'll see you next time. Bye.